John from J.O. Ventures Outdoors, and today I want to participate in an open tag that I've been watching the videos and been really wanting to participate in, and that is one brought to us by none other than Terry's Knives and Man Stuff, and uh, that is the uh, Saturday Stockman Stampede, and uh, so I just really wanted to participate in this, show some of my Stockmans. I don't have a lot of Stockmans, but I've got a few, and the one in front of you is really one of my favorites. Um, and uh, this was a gift from uh, Randy's WSG, and this is an Uncle, Uncle Henry. Uh, it's an Uncle Henry uh, 897UH, so we can see that right there. Uh, USA, Schrade USA, 897UH, Uncle Henry. And uh, it's got the plus there, so they're stainless steel blades. And you've got the Uncle Henry shield there and beautiful bone covers. These are probably Staglon, be my guess. Nickel silver bolsters, brass pins, uh, brass liners. Um, beautiful uh, Turkish clip point blade. I really love the blade, that blade shape on a Stockman. And uh, so very cool. Very cool um, sheep's foot blade, of course. And this is extremely sharp knife. Um, he sent this to me as a gift. And uh, we've given each other <laughs> knives back and forth and slips and all kinds of stuff. So I don't remember the, the actual circumstance here. But I think I was probably making a slip for him or something. And... Um, and then I think he threw this in as an extra. And, you know, Randy gets good deals. So I think <clears throat> the only thing that he said was somebody burnt the end of this. Well, I don't care. Uh, this is a great knife. And when I got this out, uh, what made me think of this was he did a video the other day and mentioned that he gave me one like the one he was showing in his video. Uh, if I can find that video, I'll, I'll put it down below so you'll have the reference. But that's what made me think of this. And decided I want to start showing some of my Stockmans. I've been kind of getting into Stockmans lately and, and carrying one almost every day here recently, and I'll show you that in a minute as a comparison. Um, I really tried to find the year on this. I couldn't figure out when this was made, but I think it's sometime maybe in the late 90s, early 2000s, because I, I believe they made these in the USA with this Tang stamp until 2004, but I don't know that for sure. If you know, I'll put it put it in the chat. I'd love to see that. I'd love to figure that out. I just couldn't find it. and uh, But I did find a video that was um, really informative by Island Outdoors 1, and so I'll put that down below um, to give a little more information. And, you know, if we do a little comparison, the Stockman I've been carrying, here's my Randy's WSG slip, of course, um, and my new bead um, from RDS Wood Kerning. Uh, I've been carrying this large Rough Rider, uh, large Stockman. So you can kind of see this is a medium Stockman, and you can kind of see the size there. We'll do a little, uh, get our little ruler over here and do a little measuring. So close the lengths about three and a half, uh, about three and a half. Main clip point blades about two and a half uh, cutting edge. So yeah, about two and a half cutting edge. So there's your approximate size, about the size of an 18, you know, uh, pattern from from uh, case. So this is the large stockman from Rough Rider. Um, and um, so a little bit smaller than that, a little easier to carry, uh, very slim. I just, I really like this knife. Um, it's super sharp too. Um, it just, you know, it's pretty sharp. Well, if I get it on there right. Yeah, see, you know, it's pretty sharp. So um, I really enjoy this. So. Big shout out to Terry's Nice Man Stuff for this uh, Saturday Stockman Stampede open tag. And uh, really have enjoyed seeing everyone's Stockmans. I'll show you a few more 
here in the coming weeks. And thank you to Randy for this gift from a little while back. And uh, so check out both those channels and I'll put a couple other videos down below for you to check out. I hope you all have a great weekend. Thank you all for watching.